September 20th. Try to see things more and more from my perspective. Let the light of my presence so fully fill your mind that you view the world through me. When little things don't go as you had hoped, look to me lightheartedly and say, oh well, this simple discipline can protect you from being burdened with an accumulation of petty cares and frustrations. If you practice this diligently, you will make a life-changing discovery. You will realize that most of these things that you worry that worry you are not important. If you shrug them off immediately and return your focus to me, you will walk through your days with lighter steps and a joyful heart. When serious problems come your way, you will have more reserves for dealing with them. You will not have squandered your energy on petty problems. You may even reach the point where you can agree with the Apostle Paul that all your troubles are light and momentary compared with the eternal glory being achieved by them. Based on Proverbs 20 verse 24 and 2 Corinthians 4, 17 through 18. The word of the Lord adapted by a wonderful, benevolent author. Author is Sarah Young. This is my favorite book. It's called Jesus Calling. It's a daily devotional book. There is a page or a section for every day of the year. Meg's going to read from today's section. I try to see things more and more from... I can't do it with that stuff in the background. you got to turn it. Uh, that is what six to James, but the suspect was under I-5. Ray pulled the machete on the collar. Meg doesn't like this ham radio blaring police signals in the background, so I'm going to turn it off.